Chris Logan here, Walnut Ridge, with another Walkthrough Wednesday. I'm with the um, 2021 Passport 268BH Bunkhouse. I um, just want to show you a couple things about it. One of the nicest things I, nicest things I think on most of the passports now, are this rear access door. And I will note, um, Greer, over here, please that there is no latch on the inside. I've had a lot of customers thinking their kid's gonna escape if there was a, a handle to open it. And when I was a kid, I would have escaped too. I, I would now still. So no handle there, access it there. This bunk goes up. You can throw your coolers, some bikes. It does latch up there or things like that in there. So one thing new on the passport porch this year is a fullable, fully walkable roof. So you've got the ladder here, you climb up there, do your maintenance that you need to do there. Um, most of the bunkhouses do have a outside kitchen or a camp kitchen in this case. Nice little refrigerator. Two burner stove. Um, some people say, why is it not a griddle type? You can just set a little cast iron lodge griddle on top of that and it, it works, work, works perfect. Um, other people say, why does it not have a sink? Well, your outside shower is moved to over here. This little quick connect there, put your spray nozzle on there. You know, if you had something you needed to spray here or clean or dirty boots or things like that, it's, it's right there. So that's, that's kind of a nice new addition, putting that there. Outlet out here, got a full, almost full length awning with LED lights up under there. Electric stabilizers, it is an extended camping season. It is solar ready as well. Um, huge pass-through storage. It's called a, a, a slam latch door. Magnetic up there. On the front here, the uh, electric tongue jack. So it's just ready to go. It makes it a lot easier with the electric stabilizers as well. So. Uh, screen door friction hinge door so it's not going to blow shut when you're in there you don't have to latch it as well so let's take a look on the inside guys i mean we're just inside the door and coming in um, one of the new things passports done basically in the last six months is add a lot of storage i mean no wasted space that's just great you could put a trash can there if you wanted or it opens on the other side so you could put it there as well so um have a nice, nice, you know, these open really easy sometimes. Sliding doors, they're magnetized together. So there's a little bit of privacy. One thing in the passports, they all do uh, have a full 30, not 30, 60 by 80 queen size bed. I like it that the, um, these are pretty tall, pretty deep with hang up in there, but they don't go all the way down so your elbows and things aren't gonna get jammed up in there. Again, if you look, there is storage everywhere. Where you could fit in there. Let me see. Can you go in there? I'll hold the camera. No, it's okay. <laughs> you know, one of the um, nicest things, I think, in, in the passports, it's an option, but you can get what's called the pivot furniture, which this is the pivot furniture so if we were to take these cushions out um, we can make a full-size bed you can squeeze past there um, look at how easy that was that was super easy a nice bed then when you're ready to put it up voila now it's a couch or a chaise lounge. You can kind of kind of lounge there and um, watch the television, which is over here. Speaking of the television, it does pull out. You can angle it. Uh, and um, if you look back there, ton of storage back there. Hidden storage, if you will. You could even turn it to, yeah, probably not into, into the bedroom. But um, the pivot furniture, so, you know, as you can see, Two people can sit nicely there. It'd have to really be a thin man to sit there. So that's not gonna work. 
pivoted out and you've got that seating there seating here as well now this is a bunk house but this drops down into a bed as well so a pretty good sized bed if you had that one out so two four six eight ten you could sleep ten people in this relatively easy okay we talked about storage again huge storage with shelves nice double over double bunks thing i like to point out is there's a window in the top bunk pretty good size like a transit window top and bottom and they open electrical outlets with charging ports again remember this one lifted up if you needed it and your privacy curtain nice size bathroom with a full-size shower to stand in you know if you had little kids you needed a tub for for an infant you could just put one of those little tubs in there and it, it would work nice um six cubic feet refrigerator nice freezer and again, we talked about storage. Look at this. That is huge. Greer, you could probably fit in there as well. <laughs> but anyway, this is the um, Passport 268BH. We do have it inside our showroom. If you'd like to come out and look at it, uh, thanks for watching.